Hello, it's your old pal Carl Welshman and he's back on a beer review. I've just finished this and um, I stick to my guns on my previous review of Brewdog Silk Road. I didn't like it. I did not like it all the way through, right to the end. It didn't get any better. No. Train station. No. Hopefully this beer here, this Vocation beer, is going to taste a little bit fucking better. We've got Vocation Special Edition Sense of Humidor. DDH, yes, in Double Drive Hopped IPA. Sense of Humidor. Tom Ford doesn't make DDH IPA, but if he did, woody and sophisticated base with fragrant citric highs, you won't know whether to drink it or dab it on your neck. No, I'm going to do both. Aromatic citrus sweet spice. It says silky and medium bodied, limeade and toasted coconut aromas, dry spice, pine and cedar wood. What the fuck is this? Is it is it an aftershave or beard oil or fucking drink? <laughs> uh, may contain sediment. Pour carefully. Let's have a look what we got going on now. Little smoke from the tin there, little smoke. It's not smoke though, is it? If it was smoke, then uh, God help us all. Don't know what to expect with this at all. Get this all poured out. And then we can uh, excitedly count the number of fingers for the head. Oh, that, I'm pretty sure chunks come out there. Yeah, literally fucking chunks. Let's have a look on the date on this one. Yeah, November 2023, so we're all we're all good when it comes to the day. It's just a fucking chunky drink. Ready? Let's count how many finger heads we've got here. How many fingers? Head, not finger heads. Oh, let's count how many fucking heads. Yeah, it's a one head. Foamy head. Little finger. Head. There we go. Let's have a sniff. Not really getting much of a sniff, to be honest. I think my sense of smell has been destroyed by the overpowering stench of fucking lychee and mango. Go away, you. Ah, not much. Not much on the sniff at all. What's, what's going on here? All right, well, let's have a taste. Bottom of the glass looks fucking disgusting. A lot of fucking sedimenty chunks. See that? That doesn't look good. Let's have a look. All right, look, I know I, I kind of grimaced with that first taste there, but it's actually quite nice. It's actually quite nice. Mm. It's certainly nicer than the beer I drank earlier on. It's, um, Again, it's got that full flavour. It's like proper tasty. Tasty is what it is, but I don't know whether I'm getting... I'm not getting toasted coconut. I, I agree on the silkiness. It is silky. That's a silky beer. I'm not getting coconut. Now, do you know, if it didn't say coconut on the back there, I wouldn't be lo looking for coconut. I wouldn't be looking for coconut. No. It says dry spice and pine. I'm, I, I'm definitely getting a kind of a pininess. There, there is a bitterness and there's a tang. Dab a bit on my neck. Get a bit on the old pulse points. Hit the disco tech later. Is that a sniff? Oh, in all fairness, that's disgusting. Now my wrists just smell of ass. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna have to go and have a quick wash after this. Well, that'll teach me for following the fucking back of the tin there. I mean. You won't know whether to drink it or dab it on your neck. Now my fucking, my neck is going to smell of ass now. Yeah, don't be doing that. All right. If any of you randomly get this, 
don't be dabbing it on your neck. Unless you want a smell of arse. And maybe where you're going for the night or for the day, maybe, maybe you're thinking the smell of arse is going to be approved of. Maybe even get you a promotion in your job. Um, but for me personally, I don't want a smell of arse. Back to the beer. Nice, creamy, cloudy. It is silky. It's a strong, robust body. Um, yep, oh, <laughs> bit of fucking drilling going on there next door. They're doing a bit of DIYs. Um, let's summarize here before they ruin the rest of this fucking video. <sighs> Vocation, sense of humidor. You've been in my fridge for a while. I've been waiting for the right time to drink it. I thought today would be that time. Um, it is. It is. Oh, I only just worked out the bloody cigars all over there. I was trying to work it out. I was like, what is fucking cinnamon? Why is this cinnamon on it? It is, and it is cigars. Yeah, you know what? If you smoke cigars, have a little sip of this. Absolutely perfect. It smells alright in the glass. Kind of wore off on the wrists, thank God, but I'll probably still give them a little rinse. I can't see. I'd be in a massive fucking hurry to buy another tin of this. It's not one that's making me go, wow, that's incredible. Um, It's doing the job for now. Vocation, sense of humidor, double dry hopped IPA. I'm going to give you a six out of ten. That'll do, pig. That'll do.